Hello everyone and welcome to another Minecraft video and we are on the Minecraft map season 4 on the play Minecraft server the IP will be in the description below so you're probably wondering what am I doing here well I myself am a very huge fan of Minecraft it's a uh, it's uh, something that I've watched for a while. I've mostly watched through. Sun just came out through certain certain YouTuber, and it got to me watching almost every single YouTuber. But I somehow know everyone's names. I don't know how that works, but still, uh, if you are a fan of Minecraft, however, I. I'm doing a little server tour because I am a huge fan of Minecraft, so I thought, hey, this would be a great idea to do. Fireworks. You, you gotta love them. So, uh, without further ado, let's get on with everything. Uh, just a little FYI. I am not going to get to everyone's, like, build. I'm mostly gonna go around spawn, but... I'm gonna see if I can't find anyone else's uh, builds and see if I can't remember who built them. Because, like I said, I'm subscribed. Uh, I'm subscribed to some of uh, the YouTubers, but not all of the Minecrackers. So we start off here. This is the town hall made by B Double O. Uh, I love his channel. He does amazing builds. Can you actually open these? No. Oh, hey, you can. Can I? Take this. Is this seriously possible? No, because it's back in there. Yeah, okay. Well, I thought that was something. Here's the message board. This originally was uh, put out here by Paul Swords Jr., I believe. Minecraft Catacombs. This was originally built for the Death Games. I love Minecraft a lot. <laughs> I know so many things. So this is the original spawn town area. Um, let's go around this way and loop around. So here is the warning under construction. This is Arcus's of the uh, Minecraft Theater. And it was a... Uh, a build, I don't know if we can actually get in. Uh, he probably closed it for the uh, server tour. Do the beacons not work? I'm gonna, no, I guess it does work. Hmm, excuse me. So that was built by Arcus. One pause donate. Bunch of stuff. This, I believe, is just a random police box. For some reason, I feel as though it's a TARDIS, but I could be wrong. This may or may not be a Doctor Who reference, but I don't remember or recall anyone actually revealing who built this. If you do, please leave in the comments below, but for some reason, if it's like a TARDIS, it's a Doctor, to Doctor Who reference, I would think it would be a build from Kurt J. Mac, but I don't know. This is the Medical Tent, I believe, uh, by Jay Sano. Jaysano19 uh, Yeah, it's a pretty nice tent actually uh, Here we have the dock shop by DocM77 Name tags uh, Apparently he was still doing the uh, stuff Oh, no one paid for it um, Yeah, dock shop Again, another great YouTuber Oh, I get it This map isn't actually 100% updated because this is supposed to be the flower shop that BTC builds and if you actually watch his channel this should be like what two stories high it's a nice flower shop actually so uh I guess not all the builds here are complete uh so sorry for that I guess this is the death games that was constructed by Etho, 
Etho Slab, Mr. Slab, all the stuff's in here. Who's in Death Games? No one is. Yeah, it didn't do anything. Uh, so we made it all the way around there. Let's go here. This is eventually going to be Pause's Hitman shop. Uh, but I guess it never was open. This was like a fish tank, Agent 47. This was originally made by uh, Vintage Beef. This is supposed to do something. Pretty sure it turns on and off the lights that are in here. Yeah, there's a light down there. Pretty sure it's a redstone lamp. Here is the outdated library. This was made by Pyro Puncher, one of my favorites. Got Dion and Infinity Book, P00 and Beef. This is a pretty good build. I don't know why he uh, got rid of it. He eventually made it so that it was updated to the uh, snapshot I believe they were building. Uh, this is Anders's uh, fishing hut. Don't think I want to go down here. Oh, I'm stuck. Where am I? Okay, so yeah, this was made by Anders. His fishing shop. Can we get in? Parkour. Yeah, Anders L's fishing school. Oh, okay. Same thing. Uh, where were we? I guess we'll move on to the uh, wood farm. This is the wood farm made by Baj. W92 Baj. If broken, lift hatch and fill hole with sand. Oh, I'm stuck in here. Right? Nope. Uh, logic. So this was a very complicated contraption where you get wood. How much wood could chuck chuck if a wood could chuck could chuck wood? Pretty sure uh, Baj would be able to answer that. Um, here we have the King Clucky Chicken Restaurant. Uh, this was made by BTC and it's temporarily closed due to infestation. But you gotta remember that this is an outdated map. Alright, so I think there were two builds that contradicted each other here, both dealing with the Lapis Exchange. So here we have Pyro's Lapis Exchange Plus, and it's a modern built made by B00. Very nice, very nice. This is MC Gamers uh, Lapis Exchange, apparently not having all the prices up yet uh, forgive me if stuff goes uh, wrong er, and whatnot like lag like this happens because I am pretty laggy here so as you can see it took a while um, I don't remember who made this the mind crack mail because uh, like I said I don't watch everyone's videos as it takes up a lot of time so sorry again um, let's move here I guess this is a Trader Junior's trading post so basically I guess anyone who wanted to trade or got mail uh, this is all made by uh, Paul Soares Jr. I believe and I love the way how this was designed it looks very very nice Oh, by the way, I have Fly, because this is technically on the Play Minecraft server, so I can do that. Uh, here is Pyro's... What's this? Oh, I guess this is Wire. This is Pyro's uh, interview slash... Uh, what's it? Um, can't remember. News station here. Uh, I believe the exterior was made by B00 and the interior was made by Beef. So far, you know that Pyro knows and make his own builds. Haha. <laughs> uh, I missed a couple builds over here. So this is the uh, B Dubs 1.7 Building Company. Obviously, uh, it would no longer function. 
because it, they were playing on the snapshot. This is under construction. I believe this is also made by Arcus, I believe. I'm not 100% sure. Sorry if I get it wrong. Uh, here, I believe this is the museum. No, this is Seth Bling's one click farm. Oh god. Oh, I thought these were fence gates. Construction's important. Yeah, I wouldn't think that would work. Oh god, I'm stuck in here now, aren't I? Ah. Oh, I was hoping the lag would work in my favor. Okay, well, it looks like we gotta go down. I lied. Let's click this again. Um, let's see here, I think that is everything in there. Let's head back around and then we're gonna have to go down that road. So, uh, I believe I mentioned everything here already. These are very fantastic builds, by the way. Um, are we getting part to the part where it's very laggy? I don't know. This, I believe, was supposed to be an orange wool place. I believe this was made by MC Gamer. Don't know what it eventually came to be, because uh, most of the people I watch don't come to this area. Uh, oh, I missed this. I missed these. Or should I? No, we're already here. So this was Zisto's farm. It was a farm. It was made by Zisto. I believe it was made for anyone having trouble getting food and whatnot. Zisto eventually did, this I do remember, eventually made this here but a different color as I would say a prank. Oh, okay, the redstone. Here. Oh, okay, well, this one does work, I guess. Um, this is Bling Mark, made by none other than uh, Seth Bling. It's a very nice shop, I would have to say. Um, I think this is done for this area. Let's head back this way to move on to Ethos Build uh, Etho Corp. Also, this bridge here, I believe, was a collaboration between Etho and uh, B Dubs, but I'm not 100% sure. I remember Etho and B Dubs uh, working on this. So, this is Etho Corp. I'm pretty sure the redstone is disabled here for lag purposes. That, that is deceiving. Uh, the original Zisto isn't here. Oh, this is the uh, Etho Corp, by the way. This is a potion shop where you can get all your potions and stuff. It's a pretty cool place. You should be able to get behind here, but I guess not. Uh, you need like a music disc or something. Oh god. Can I get out of there alive? Yes. Uh, Etho also made this. Underneath here, I believe, is supposed to be a prank for something. If I can break this, maybe, can I? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, there's chests in there. This was originally a prank that he would do as being the e-pranker. In here, he would have Taylor Swift, his horse. Uh, eventually here, he would make Etho, uh, Etho, uh, E-Mart. Right, Etho Mart, E-Mart. And then he built his own custom tree here. I forgot the name of it, but it was pretty, pretty funny. Uh, over here, I believe this is Generic Bee's uh, breeding ground. Again, sorry if I mess anyone's builds up and mistake them for someone else's. But, I just don't remember. Alright, now there is one place I'm concerned about visiting, but I don't know where it is, which may or may not be a good thing. But we'll see when the time comes to it. Uh, let's go back all the way over here 
to the main road and again sorry for the lag my ping isn't the best as you can see I only have like three bars Parkour skills for days. Just by Blinger Mart, which was supposed to be there, but we got Bling Mart. Uh, there is another road branching off from one of these directions. Uh, no, maybe yes. Firework. Oh, someone with firework in there. Oh yeah, I believe. There was a prank right here, Kurt's uh, potato on a stick farm. It was left for B00 here. Oh yes, this is something I really wanted to see. The Minecraft UHC statues. I'm not 100% how updated this is. Oh, not very updated. Uh, Goo, Jisano, the gyms. And if this were 100% completed, there would be a lot more mind crackers. This was made. I'm gonna fly up here because it's a pretty big building. This was made by none other than the one who has the most patience, Adlington, because anything he builds is very large scale and very complicated to build because he has obsidian and quartz which are two things that are, are a pain to get in minecraft legit so this was uh, originally his casino uh, let's just fly everywhere now so we've been there I believe can we go to the nether if we can that'd be pretty cool if not there's still some other things Ah, here we go. Here is... Can I fly in here? I guess not. Alright, so this is the nether hub made by Vita Below. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Seth Bling's base. Uh, I would show you everyone's base, but because of time reasons, I don't feel like doing so. I hurt myself because I can do that. Oh yeah, it's because flies and I'm able to There's just so many bases that I actually want to uh, show you guys. Hole through bedrock. Oh yeah, that's right, because Doc has figured out a way to break bedrock using dark oak trees. I think this is still actually implemented into the game, but it's only useful if you do it in the nether, because if you do it in the uh, overworld, not really much to do except fall. Aha! So here is the top of the nether. I don't think anything was actually built here. Down. Uh, we're gonna go back to the nether portal because I believe I forgot to show you a couple of builds that are semi near spawn. These nether portals are very loud if they are in large scale. And where did we end up? In Laggy Town. I regen, but I'm not regaining any health. Am I lagging? I'm always lagging. Uh, okay. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, uh, here would be Vidya's plot, but this actually was stolen by the B team in Le B Team Shop or lay B team pastry shop actually that would eventually show up on the server I am trying to find the uh, the uh, road 
of shops. But instead, I'm going to show you some bases that were made over here. For example, B00. Oh, this is generics. This used to be generics hole in the ground, but I changed it into a vault or something. Not 100% sure, but it's cool nonetheless. Uh, here, there's the skelly farm. Oh, that's the thing where I was worried that there would be a lot of lag. This is the skelly farm. AFK, punch skellies, you know, nice things. Oh, wow. Well, sorry for the lag, everyone, because I was worried that I would start getting laggy at this point due to so many entities. So this is B00's house, by the way, base, I should say. Uh, this is actually his modern build. I was about to say, there's no poison under there, is there? Uh, ooh, this is uh, B00's building for Dinner Bone. Dinner Home, haha. <laughs> uh, there's also some E Pranker stuff here, but we'll not get into that. So, uh, Dinner Bone, if you don't know who Dinner Bone is, he is a lead creator of, in Mojang of Minecraft. Very cool guy. So, yeah, basically, if you have any problems with Minecraft, I'm playing Dinner Bone. I believe here is the uh, the pain and agony of Doc's uh, perimeter. So, for those of you who do not watch Doc M, he is actually the one who made this along with basically every Minecracker ever. This is part of the UHC, I believe. So he built his uh, base solely on uh, mob farms and to do that he would need a large perimeter to get the maximum number of spawns for this area to get the maximum amount of basically goodies as you would say because I can. Oh I get jump boost here because of the beacon. Oh I believe it. Is this perimeter still going on this far? Because I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be Dude's place for his UHC statue. Oh yes, here's the road that I was looking for. This may not actually be Dude's UHC statue stuff. This may actually be Paul Sawyer's Junior's or is his thing? Here it is! This is something I'm mistaken before. This is the Mindcrack Museum. This is uh, originally made by Paul Soares Jr. and basically anything historical, uh, you send to him. Here is, uh, I think this is Spud Service, Spud Squid Service. This is a vintage beef thing. If you recall from uh, Pause's Hitman business, he beef basically installs squid tanks for anyone who wants them. This, I believe, is Badge's uh, swords. They're really bad swords, but he would sell them nonetheless. This is a horse shop. It's pretty derpy. Andrew Zell's horsey horse shop. Here's another flower shop. From Andrew's, again. Wanting to claim this place. This is B Dub's Cat Killer Service. It says anonymous, but this is all made by BWO. This actually started because of a prank I believe Generic B did, where he placed random cats around his base. This right here is Zisto's Enderman Mender. So basically, Enderman like pick blocks. He is your guy. I uh, yeah, I wanted to go here before. Uh, let's head back because there are some more shops. Uh, FYI, some mind crackers, I don't know where who's base, where they are. For example, MC Gamer, don't know where he is. Edmonton, don't know where he is. Kurt, he, like, is rare on the server. I don't, I don't even know if he even built a base around here. Um, 
uh, Arcus, don't know where he is, Andrezo, he's like some place, Avidia, I think, had a shop somewhere, there's a large nether portal in there, because I can hear it. Uh, Vidya, I know he has his dojo, but I don't remember or recall where it is. I think this is all for the tour. So, let's head back to spawn. If I can get there, I'll eventually get there, guys. Don't worry. So, let's talk a little bit about Minecraft. So, Minecraft, uh, like I said before, I am like a huge fanboy, I guess you could say. Only oh, some more builds. This is where Etho captured a super cooper, I believe. But then it disappeared or despawned. I don't remember what this was. But obviously honoring some deaths. Don't remember this was. Sorry if I'm offending anyone who likes these people and herps. Uh, so yeah, like I said before, so, and then this map isn't fully updated as well, so like Aurelian, Vex, Sevidus, all these newish Minecrackers, I don't believe their bases are here. Vex actually might be somewhere. Um, so, and also, uh, Zisto, don't know where he is, I believe Good has his base somewhere off in there, I fell in the water because I'm amazing. And I, I needed to take a bath after running over everywhere. Everywhere. Sorry about the horrible singing. I'm trying to get back to Town Hall here. A lot of redstone went into that wood farm. Uh, we're almost there. So, yeah, Mindcrack, it's starting its new season. Probably by the time this video goes up and the lag happens again and it is very much real so yeah uh, because I don't want to push favorites I'm not gonna tell you who I actually watch the most who I don't watch and stuff but I will however say that mind crack is a community that I truly love unlike most uh, Places and channels that have been made. Mindcrack is a very, very nice community that I have come to love. They do lots of charity things and they are just amazing people who make good videos, unlike me who is a noob. That's it. Um, so. Yeah, by the time this video goes up, I believe I'm going to be posting this on Saturday. I'm trying to get a bunch of pre-recording done because I won't be able to uh, record anything on the weekend. So, Mindcrack is coming this weekend of, I believe, the 19th of July. Uh, that's when this video is going up. Mindcrack starts somewhere there season five and I, I hope it's to be a good season I want to see some uh, I want to see some more minecrackers actually get on the server because uh, I haven't seen them play on the minecraft server as much however I do watch like their other series of, so of s sorts and stuff and uh, yeah, that's me done fanboying and giving the tour of this amazing server. Uh, I hope you have all enjoyed this uh, tour video. I hope you are a huge fan, fan of Minecraft as much as I am. And remember to enjoy watching them. Not advertising. Well... If you don't want to watch them it's your choice however i am excited for next season season five i hope you have all enjoyed it again repeating what i just said before and i'll see you guys next time uh take care and goodbye